Hello, my name's Alexandra. Thanks to MACAL, Lauren Garrick and I were given the opportunity to attend an internship at the Institute of Economic Affairs in Westminster, London for three months over the summer break. As a research intern at the IEA, we had the freedom to pursue a research project of our own interest, with the final product being a research report and presentation to our colleagues and fellow interns at the IEA. So my overall conclusion drawn is that given the limited ability of the government to provide the basic necessities of life for citizens in the third world, microfinance is the best alternative to alleviating poverty. Westminster was a really amazing place to, to work. Each day we'd walk past Big Ben and the House of Parliament and it's sort of a hub of libertarian thought. So we have the Adam Smith Institute around the corner, the Tax Players Alliance and so many other free market initiatives um, right at our fingertips. The IEA harvested a great playing field for networking, uh, holding about two events a week. One event in particular that stood out for me was the panel debate on the issue of Brexit, whether Britain should leave the um, European Union. And that provided a really interesting discussion. Yeah. Having different sides of the debate, some were in favour of Britain leaving and some were not. I actually went to one event, the Ronald Reagan lecture hosted by the Margaret Thatcher Centre and I heard from Ed Meese, a close advisor and confidant of Ronald Reagan throughout his political career about some intimate details of the relationship between Margaret Thatcher and himself which was really interesting. Not only were we exposed to um, different ideas, we were able to network with different people yeah. um, who were affiliated with the IEA as well, so inside and outside of the institute, yeah. which was great. So one of the great things about working at the IEA was that we had the opportunity to meet people from all around the world. One person in particular who was a great person to meet uh, was Christina Hayek, the daughter of uh, Nobel Prize winning economist um, Friedrich Hayek. Yeah. And she was lovely and it was great to get insight into the workings of her father firsthand. Not only did uh, living and working in London really give us a chance to explore the city, we also made the most of its proximity to the rest of Europe. So over Christmas I took a bit of a trip abroad. I went to Vienna, Budapest and Bratislava, which was amazing. Um, I was able to go to Norway. Uh, we went to Poland. I had the opportunity to go to France and Belgium with uh, Rebecca Lawrence, the intern at the Lithuanian Free Market Institute. Uh, and within the UK we also did um, quite a lot of travelling. Yeah, we went to Cambridge one day with another intern. Alex went to Wales and Windsor Castle as well. And then also, I mean, London is a huge city, so we spent a lot of our time trying to explore that and get to know the city. Of all of our amazing experiences as our scholars, from exploring London to travelling Europe, I think the most valuable thing that we've taken out of it has been the exposure to libertarian philosophy. Absolutely. I feel like our knowledge and understanding of free market economics has really grown and now we fully understand the importance of the pursuit of freedom and of free markets. Absolutely. And, and the networks we've created in London um, will never be lost. On behalf of Garrick, Lauren and I, we'd like to thank um, the ManCal team and Ron Manners in particular for giving us this amazing opportunity, as well as the Institute of Economic Affairs for having us as interns. Thank you very much. Thank you.